Claypool. Big dish touchdown for Claypool. There's a lot to be excited about Chase Claypool out of Notre Dame. You know, the Steelers drafted him. You heard he's big, he's strong, he's fast. He has a wide radius to catch the ball, all true. But the thing that really stands out in tape that I like the most to give him the best chance to transition to the NFL and be an impact player is his subtleties in route running, how he actually utilizes that to get open. I'm going to show you some plays that really illustrate what makes him special. All right, here's a good example of Claypool, the right of the screen. Now, this is going to be an outbreaking route, but I want you to watch the subtleties, the little wrinkles that he does well. Watch the stem of the route. He attacks the defender on the inside, keeping the defender's hips to the inside, and he's got him turning and running. Well, once you have him in that position, there is no way he can make an outbreaking move to defend Claypool. Second and eight, he attacks the defender on the inside. Now he makes it easy on the quarterback for a good throw to the outside. Second and eight, just turned to first and 10. Here, Claypool's lined up close to the formation on the left side. Now what makes this important is you create matchups with him. The NFL is all about matchups and Claypool played everywhere, inside and outside. So at the snap of the ball, watch who covers him, a linebacker. Now in college, that's a mismatch, but in the NFL, it could be a mismatch, especially with his speed and he's clearly big enough. And even safeties, it'll be a mismatch. So he's a matchup problem for defenses too. And the Steelers will use him like that. In scoring territory, Claypool is lined up to the right. Well, this is all about matchups, and he'll do this in the NFL as well. Getting him one-on-one -on -one and getting him the ball. Well, a great job of setting up the defender inside, and look at all of the space to the right where the quarterback can fill the football. And with his wide radius, that's gonna be an easy throw and an easy catch. They make it work here, wasn't the best throw, but he's gonna be a matchup nightmare in the red zone. This is my favorite play in studying Chase Claypool. He's at the top of the screen. Now here's what I love about him. He's got great speed. So some guys with great speed, they just run by you and they can do that in college. In the NFL, you have to learn to utilize your speed, set up defenders, little wrinkles. Well, that's exactly what he does here. Let's watch what he does at the top of the route. See that little wiggle? He climbs the defender, sets the defender up, and then explodes past him. Well, when you do this, I don't care who the safety is in the NFL, if you'll do little things like this and maximize your speed, you're gonna be dynamic, especially explosively vertically. And that's exactly what he did and he can do as he transitions to the National Football League. There are a lot of things to like about Chase Claypool. A lot of people get caught up in his size and speed. Those are good things. But the things we saw on tape are just as important, maybe more important when you transition to the NFL because it's the little things that help you become a great player. And he already does them fairly well, so you don't have to teach him. He already does them. And with the limited time they have had to work together, especially with Ben, it's going to help him be a major contributor and a major contributor in an explosive way. So Steeler Nation, you got to be excited about Chase Claypool in this coming season.